morning, everyone. I hope you guys are feeling awesome. I just woke up like two minutes ago. Literally, I just woke up. You can clearly tell by my voice. Uh, you, I still kind of have my morning voice. Like two minutes ago, I just woke up and right away I take my phone and then filming this just because I want to tell you that I just woke up. And also I want to tell you why that I just woke up. So last night I went to sleep very late I spent hours watching Squid Game. Okay, train, please. I'm recording. This is what you get when you live near the railway. Okay. Okay, so, so it was a little bit conflicted for me whether I should go watch it or not because like, I know it's trending. I know it's happening. I know it's everywhere, but trending doesn't mean it's good, right? And then I asked my friends in group chat whether I should go watch it, is it worth the hype? And then one of my friends was like, JC, you don't need to rationalize everything, just go watch it. And then I was like, I mean, if it's not good, I'm not watching it because I don't want to spend hours, like nine to 10 hours watching a series and ended up not liking it because that's a waste of time. I don't want to waste my time. Like every second, every minute of my life is very important. No, I'm just kidding, but that's not a little amount of time, right? And then some of them were like, JC, it's good, just go watch it. And then I was like, okay, fine, I watch it. And then episode one in, and I was like, it's good, it's good. And then I continued episode two, episode three, episode four, and then it's, it's getting late at night. And then, you know, when, you know, like every time you watch series, there's always that time that you want to stop and then continuing it tomorrow just because it's late at night, but you want to know what happens next. So you kept continuing until you finish it until the end. And that's what I've done. That's what I've done last night. I watch it until one in the morning and ended up not regretting it. It's good. It's like literally so good. But you kind of know what's going to happen like in the end, you know, it's a little bit expected, the ending, but it's still good. It doesn't change the fact that it's a good series. It's really good. There's also a lot of plot twists. So yeah, if you're like conflicted like me, just I recommend you to watch it because you're not going to regret it. It's just good. And by the way, this video is going to be filmed in several days. I'm going to be filming some part of the video today. The rest of the video is tomorrow because there's going to be a little bit surprise tomorrow. You're going to see it. I mean, just you're going to see it. So yeah. Alright guys, so it's rainy day. It's raining again, which makes me very happy because like rainy day is like my favorite thing ever. It's, I don't know, like I just love it, you know? And it's drizzling now, but it says on the weather app that it's gonna be pouring in the next 30 minutes. So I'm like waiting for it because when it's pouring, I feel like I wanna go outside and just like getting myself in the rain and then, oh my God, I'm sorry. Just like getting myself in the rain and you know, like just romanticizing my life and trying to be like the main character. I mean, I'm basically the main character in my own life. So yeah, I really want to go outside. Oh my God, it's drizzling again. It's like fluid tweeted, but when it's like really big, when it's pouring, I don't know, I just feel like I want to go outside. I don't know. See, it's a fake candle, but just like, it's kind of like set the mood. If there is something that you want to do that harms nobody and benefits you, you do it. Be a little bit selfish here for a second. Think only about yourself for a second. What's going to make you the most happy? Update, I've changed my mind. I don't go outside because it's thunderstorms and I don't want to die. Uh, well, this weather is like my favorite kind of weather. I love it so much. Like rainy days, like something about rainy day makes me feel so nostalgic and it's also therapeutic. But the temperatures is always so humid that I can't even wear my clothes on. 
Because if I do, I'm gonna get so sweaty and it feels so soggy and I don't like it. So I did take my coat off and I didn't go outside. So it's the next day and I just showered. And when yesterday I said that there's gonna be a surprise, it's more like a surprise that you've never seen me doing this before, which I'm going outside. Yes, I mean, you've seen me going outside before, but maybe just taking a walk along the paddy field or going on my rooftop or going to a mosque for praying. I've never, you've never seen me like really in a public place. And today I'm gonna be going to a public place. So I'm going to the city uh, with my friends and yeah, I do have friends. If you're like, I didn't have friends, then you're wrong because I have a lot of friends. Like, a lot. Let me count. To have like two friends, yeah, I have friends, but not a lot. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, most of my friends are from high school though, like, because frankly, I don't make friends after high school, and I didn't have friends before high school. By the way, I was like wearing this lip balm. No idea what I'm gonna wear. Like, okay. So this is a definite. Wearing a t-shirt. Oh great, my glasses. Like, should I wear? Should I wear a shirt or a sweater? I have no idea whatsoever. Cause I don't have pants. I've been wearing the same pants every time I go outside and it's just so annoying, you know? Whether it's this brown corduroy or the overall, you know, this one. And I want to borrow my brothers, but I don't like theirs just because they're all skinny jeans and I don't like skinny jeans. Ugh. Okay, so I'm gonna do the rest and I'll be right back. So I did curl all of my hair and it's not bad. I don't quite like it, but it's not that bad. I honestly don't see a point of me doing this whatsoever just because I know it's gonna be ruined in the next 30 minutes because I'm gonna be wearing helmet. So. I don't give a fuck about you anyways. Whoever said I gave a shit about you. And here is my outfit of the day. If you don't like it, you could leave. Wait.
Mendingan Amerikan oke okay, mas. <laughs> We are in kopi bawah pohon. So I just got home and I'm so tired. I feel so exhausted, but it was really fun. But now I'm so sleepy and look at my bed. Oh my God. My bed's calling me. I'm about to go to sleep and I hope you enjoy this video. And by the way, there's something I want to talk about just before I end this video. So basically on my last video, I said that I'm going to post like every Friday. But I think that's such a bold statement for me saying that because knowing the fact that I'm a huge procrastinator, it just, well, don't worry, I'm still going to post like one video per week, but it's not going to be Friday. Well, it could be Friday, it could be Saturday, it could be Sunday, it's going to be like, or it could be Thursday, even earlier. I'm just not going to say an exact day when I'm going to post it, but yeah. So I hope that's okay. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. So yeah, see you next week. Bye bye everybody. I wanna go to sleep. Wait, bye bye everybody. Good night.